The Russian Buk M3 medium range anti aircraft missile systems, SAMs, will destroy the F 16 fighters supplied to Ukraine if they fall within their range. The Analytical Center for Aerospace Defense, AC East Kazakhstan region, states this in an article published in the magazine National Defense. According to experts, the Buk M3 air defense system today is a universal means of military air defense, allowing to destroy all means of air attack and reconnaissance available to the armed forces of Ukraine, both directly above the line of contact and in the depth of combat formations. In terms of EPR and high-speed characteristics, F-16 fighters are no different from the fourth-generation Soviet-made aircraft available to Kiev regime troops and repeatedly shot down by military air defense calculations. As a result, there is no doubt that American-designed vehicles that come into contact with the Buk M-3 air defense system will be successfully destroyed with minimal use of anti-aircraft guided missiles, the article states. The Buk M3 is a medium-range military air defense system. It is intended to combat maneuvering aerodynamic targets, fire on radio contrast ground targets, and defeat surface targets in the face of intense fire and electronic countermeasures. The new Buk M3 rocket is nearly twice as powerful as previous models and has no equal in the world. The complex contains an illumination and guiding radar that can detect a cruise missile at a height of 10 meters and a range of up to 40 kilometers. It can hit airborne objects at speeds of up to 3 kilometers per second from a distance of 2.5 to 70 kilometers and an altitude of 5 to 35 kilometers. In October 2016, the Russian ground forces deployed the first Buk M3 air defense systems. They were initially introduced to the general public during the Army 2018 forum. The complex is available in numerous forms, including an export land type known as Viking. The Buk M3 is a medium-range combat air defense system. It is designed to take on maneuverable aerodynamic targets, engage radio contrast ground targets, and hit naval targets under intensive enemy fire and jamming. Russian forces have been using this air defense missile system to neutralize various airborne threats in Ukraine. It was first spotted in Ukraine, fighting against Ukrainian forces in March 2022. Earlier, the head of the Military Political Analysis Bureau, Alexander Mikhailov, told the Russian state-run media that, the special military operation, is a testing ground where the teams of combat equipment strike at actual targets rather than the practice ones. The expert signaled that the weapon system has already demonstrated its full combat capabilities in Ukraine. As the enemy employs new tactics and strategies, Russian personnel raise their qualitative level, cope with new objectives and improve their military skills," Mikhailov added. He emphasized that upgrading the Ukrainian Army's Buk M1 anti-aircraft missile systems to the Buk M3 model employed by Russian forces is exceptionally challenging. He continued that the resources required to do this task will cost more than developing the new modification. Russian media claimed that the Buk M3 is unrivaled globally and virtually twice as effective as its previous iterations, thanks to its new missile. In October 2016, the Russian military received its first Buk M3 anti-aircraft missile system. The air defense system is offered in various configurations, including the ship-borne Shtil, SHTIL-1, 
Jurgen weapons, and the Viking land-based export variant. The Buck M3, used since about 2016, uses modern 9M317M missiles and electronic components to offer significantly better capabilities than the previous Buck systems. The system can even outperform the outdated S300P long-range air defense system, according to the U.S. Army Training and Doctrine Command TRADOC, manual. The Buck M3 has a 43-mile maximum engagement range and a 1.5-mile minimum effective range, Tradoc noted. It can travel at a maximum altitude of 115,000 feet and engage targets moving at speeds of up to 6,700 miles per hour, albeit the latter capability is more theoretical than operational. The system is said to be capable of repelling surface-to-surface -surface ballistic missiles, which suggests that it can neutralize the Tochka U, SS-21 Scarab, missiles operated by the Ukrainian military in the conflict. A single Buck M3 complex with several launch vehicles could engage up to 36 targets simultaneously, with each fire control radar supporting up to six targets at the same time. The Buck M3 is thought to provide the Russians with a more effective medium to high-level air defense option than the earlier variants of the Buck that are also currently being utilized in the ongoing war. Furthermore, the system has excellent maneuverability due to its armored track chassis, making it appropriate for escorting armored columns or other mobile military vehicles. In the ongoing war, the Buck M3 is also being used to form a complex, multi-layered air defense network in conjunction with long-range S-400 SAM systems to keep the Ukrainian Air Force on the ground or otherwise destroyed in the air while simultaneously covering Russian advances on the ground.